Numbrosia is a new kind of puzzle application in a world where it's oversaturated with puzzle applications for the iPhone and the iPod Touch. Here in the settings we have basic look and sound effect settings. There's a really nice tutorial you can view as well. And then let's go right into the puzzles. So the object of the game here is to get all of these uh, squares in the 5x5 grid to turn to zero. As you can see, there are numbers in there right now. Some of them are negative, some of them are positive. And so we have to do simple gestures uh, by moving rows and doing simple addition and subtraction to get them to move to zero. And then once they're all zero, we pass the level. As you can see, we've got our goal or our score here and the world record score here. So we're looking to get the least amount of moves as possible and that's how we score in this app. I mean you can complete the level, it could take you 30 moves, but that's not going to get you uh, a world record. So let's go back to uh, the beginning. I'm going to go and abandon this game that I was in and I'm going to go back to the first level just to show you the basics. So you can move columns and rows up and down and left and right simply by dragging on them. You can tap on rows and decrease a number and you can tap and increase a number. So as you'll notice if I tap from top to bottom it decreases the number and if I tap from bottom to top it increases the number. So what I'm going to want to do here is increase that number, move those rows, and then decrease that number and now I've got zeros. Of course I did that in 12 moves which wrecked my score so I can go ahead and try again and see if I can get this right this time. Oops, I went backwards. Let's undo. That's another nice thing is undo. You can undo and it doesn't count against you. It removes that move. There we go. Four moves. Tied the world record. So I could try again. Say I didn't get it in four moves. I got it in five, but I knew exactly what I needed to do. I could hit try again and go ahead and, uh, and get that tie for the world record. Or I can view the scorecard and go and view the scorecard. If I click on new puzzle down here, it will go ahead and take me to the next new puzzle that I have yet to complete, which would be puzzle number three, because I have completed puzzle number two. As you can see, they get a little bit more difficult as levels go on. Clicking new puzzle will take me to puzzle number three. And you can see there's more difficulty here yet and a world record of 10 moves, which probably means that that is the least amount of moves it's going to take to pass this level. So this game's challenging but fun at the same time. It's not difficult to pass each level, but it is difficult to pass each level in a limited amount of moves. So I definitely recommend that you check out this app, which is on special right now for 99 cents. There's also a free light version available in the App Store as well. So take care and check out Numbrosia.